Hello everyone. Hi, Danny. I'm trying to bring the mods in. There we go. All right. Hi, Anna. How are you? I know tonight is usually the dual live with my sister, but she is sick and not feeling well. And I've been like, eh, tonight too, so... <laughs> I figured I'll make it a little easier myself and just to you, um, the subscriber. I just hopped on like a minute or two ago and I know the notifications haven't been working so I've been trying to um, share the live with people that it will let me share it with. <laughs> Hi Donna, hey Trish, how are you? I'm going to give it a couple minutes for everyone to hop on. What happened with that? It just went cool. Oh, that stinks. It's fine. Did it break? No. Oh, the glue is not sticky. Just put it on your wall. <laughs> Dig it. <laughs> uh. Did everyone have a good Monday? It feels like a Monday, at least it did for me. Hi Kate, thank you. I feel like the comments are going so slow tonight. I hope TikTok's not already, like, acting up. Your Monday flew by, but flew by, <laughs> flew by. <laughs> I'm glad it did. Overdue haircut, that's good. Hi, Jim, how are you? Hi, Taylor. Tonight is the subscriber live instead of the mindful meditation Monday because my sister is not feeling well. So if you are not a subscriber, you can still consent to receive. Um, you just unfortunately don't have access to the chat. Hi, Gigi. Hey, Ivy. So I still have the list from the last, I think, two or three sessions that... I'm trying to catch up on. Thank you, Jim. Hey, Max. Hey, Jen. Um, if you're in the Telegram chat, I was saying earlier that it's getting harder and harder for me to keep up with everyone. Like, people are just, like, dropping their information and then they're leaving and I might not see them for a few weeks. And I'm trying to balance it out where everyone still gets their sessions but I'm not having to track people for weeks at a time because I still have some people on here at the top of the list from like, I think almost a month ago. And I only started doing this like five weeks ago. <laughs> so I don't want to hold people back from like the following month sessions. So I'm trying to think of ways to make it fair and balanced, but not have me feel like I'm having to chase people down or wait for people and then when TikTok did the whole name change thing that threw everything off too. Hey Courtney how are you? You're not getting them for this? I'm not sure. I'm trying to like share the lives when I can. Ivy, I think I have you on the list. Yeah, I have you on the list. Hi, 
Bye, Jill. Thank you, Jim. Thank you, Taylor. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, I woke up this morning and it said 100,000, but when you go into followers, it always rounds up. So it's still like 99,900 and like 60 something. So it wasn't really officially until this afternoon, but it was today. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, Jill. Thank you. <laughs> All right. Anna, did you already have a like a mini one on one or not yet? Thank you, Gingy. Okay, Anna, let me know what you want because I'm guessing with it being a Monday, it's probably going to be pretty slow tonight. I'm guessing most of the people I have on the list are not going to be here. Hey, Mona. Thank you, Jen. Hey, Sarah. Whoa. Comments just like swooshed. Jennifer, I'm trying to finish the list I have because I still have like 20 something people that I don't know. I try to do the lives now like once or twice a week for the subscribers, but some people, which I understand like schedules are just hectic and crazy. So like I still have people on here from like the very beginning. But I'm trying to, like, I was saying earlier, I'm trying to find a way to make it fair where, if you're in the Telegram chat, I was saying, I might just do it where you have to be on the live to get the healing because I don't want to hold other people up, you know what I mean, if they're there and waiting. But I'm also trying to keep it fair where everyone gets one, so I'm trying to think of a way to balance it. I'm playing with some ideas. Like right now I'm looking at names as they pop up and I only see, I think, one person that's on now that is still on the list. And I feel like, I feel like giving, I feel like keeping the list is keeping it fair. Cause like if you're not on, you keep getting bumped up to the top. So when you do come on, you get your session, right? But at the same time, there are people who are on every live who would love to get their next session. So it's like keeping the list is starting to give me more anxiety than it is being helpful. So if anyone has any ideas, like seriously, I am open to anything. I'm trying to I'm trying to keep it fair for everyone and not give myself anxiety at the same time. <laughs> and if you don't want to share it on here, you can message me on Instagram or if you're in the Telegram chat, just like, you know, at me on there. But I'm trying to keep it balanced. Right now, I think the only person that's on right now, I think Ivy, if you're still on, I think you're the only one I have on the list right now. I thought about doing a Google form and just linking it. Hey Prep, how are you? Namaste. Okay, Ivy, you are here. All right, so stick around, Ivy, because you'll be first. I'm going to do a quick selenite cleanse, though. And then I think Anna and Taylor, I think Anna, you said general. Taylor, I know you didn't have one yet, so just let me know what you're wanting for yours. I'm good prep, thank you. Hey Filey, how are you? Make sure you guys have water, tea, something to hydrate. You guys know the drill. <laughs> <laughs> All 
right, let's go ahead and do some Sony. As you can. No Michelle tonight. She is not feeling well. And she's still working on teaching her English classes in Nepal for the next couple of weeks. So she um, had to decline tonight. Did I get a package? I don't think so, but I did not go to the P.O. box today. My mother-in-law is going to the post office tomorrow. I'll see if she can stop and check tomorrow for me. Oh, that's why you said a month. Okay, that makes sense. I just feel like we need some kind of boundary so that like people who are consistently showing up are not missing out. You know what I mean? If I can find an easy way to do a Google form, I can do it that way. Because when you submit the Google form, it has the date on the form. This way, it would be easier for me to keep track of. Because right now, I literally am just, like, marking the list and putting lines for, like, each day. So, like, these ones I've copied from, like, the last six lists that I just randomly made. Thank you, guys. I appreciate your input and suggestions. Yeah, if it's a month out, if it's a month out, then they just have to, I guess, reapply would be the correct word. But <laughs> I'm just trying to keep it easy for me and not make it seem like it's more work than it should be. I want this to, like, be beneficial for everyone. Thank you, Jim. I might reach out to you for that. <laughs> Yeah, I think the month timeline is good. And if it starts to get really crazy and hectic, I might cut it down to like, you know, three weeks or so. All of the subscribers are not in Telegram. They have access to it, but I know quite a handful of them are not. Thank you guys. I appreciate yes, I shouldn't be a part of the journey. <laughs> it says the month time frame add them to the bottom of the list. My only concern with that, and I agree with the month timeline, because there are some people who only subscribe just for that month and they don't like auto renew or anything like that, is that like if they subscribe for the month hoping to get a session and then their days don't coincide with my subscriber only chat days, they're not getting their one on one, you know what I mean? <laughs> Uh, I still haven't figured out Telegram. Prep is the one who helps me with Telegram all the time. <laughs> I'm always messaging Prep like, help. <laughs> I can't figure this part out. <laughs> uh... <laughs> Prep, you're like my lifesaver with technology. <laughs> I 
Hi, Bailey. I think you're on the list, too, for tonight. <laughs> yes, Jim. I've been seeing a lot of repeating numbers. Hey Gwen, thank you. You too, sometime online. <laughs> okay. Let's take a minute to stretch, hydrate, get comfy. Okay. So far we have Ivy, Anna, Taylor, and Bailey. So four that are on the list. All right, let me make Ivy, Anna, Taylor, and Bailey are the first four. Okay, Ivy, let me know if you're on still and you're ready. Yours was for physical health. Okay. Ivy's ready. Okay, let me start the time. Oh, I need my neck to crack, but it won't crack. Oh, sorry. I was just thinking my throat felt tight and then I read that you said throat chakra based, so that definitely resonates. <laughs> doesn't feel like a sore throat ivy it feels like swollen like very tight so I don't know if that's what you're what you're dealing with Ooh, Jim that's exciting do in person
I feel my left side of my neck more than my right. Issues with lymphatic system and immunity. Okay. I was going to say, it doesn't feel like, like a sore throat or a cold or anything like that. It definitely feels more, um, like, deeper than that. Ash, did you already have the one on one? Do I have you on the list? I feel a pressure releasing ivy, so hopefully you're getting some relief in that area. I'm also starting to yawn a lot, so that's usually like throat chakra. <laughs> Thank you, Donna. All right, Ivy, I hope that gives you some relief. Feels better on my end. Okay. Ivy is good. Okay, Anna, are you still on? Thank you, yes, yeah, the comments are always delayed on here. Thank you, Shannon. How are you? Yeah, sometimes it's just stagnant energy that lingers. And sometimes it could be more emotional that kind of like transfers into physical. All right, Anna, you are here. Let me quickly cleanse and then we'll do yours. Yours was, I think, general. Okay. Thank you, Shannon. All right. Anna for general.
Thank you so much, Shannon. <laughs> Jim. <laughs> A puppy, I haven't seen that yet. That was so cute. <laughs> I haven't been here with visiting daughter and grandkids. I don't know who you are commenting because it has your user number, not your name. Thank you, Mona. Oh my gosh, all the dogs are so cute. <laughs> Oh, hi, Cindy. Sorry, TikTok messed everything up when they changed everything around. Oh my gosh, there's a bug too. These things are so cute. <laughs> uh... And I feel a pressure like right at the base of my skull. So I don't know if you get like tension headaches or stress headaches or anything like that. But I definitely, it doesn't feel like super strong, but that's definitely like the first place I'm noticing there's like a pressure. Hi, TT. I feel like I want to crack my neck for you <laughs> to alleviate the pressure. <laughs> Thank you, Alyssa. <laughs> so I was so cute. I'm under a lot of stress and feel it on my neck and shoulders. Okay, that definitely makes sense. Thank you, Alyssa. Yeah, no problem, Jim. Definitely go get some rest. I just felt like a wave of like warmth come over my like my neck and shoulders. <laughs> Thank you, Shannon. Those quirkies are so cute. TikTok needs to add some cat ones in there though. Thank you, Alyssa. Yeah, I mean, don't get me wrong. The dogs are adorable, but there's cat people too. <laughs> you felt it too, Anna.
I definitely feel like this area is like much more soothed now. Like it feels very calm and relaxed. I feel like a lot of the tension was released. So hopefully that translated over to you too, Anna. Yeah, lots of cat people. Oh, your kitty's in Colorado. Thank you, Donna. <laughs> Jim, I get one more joke in. <laughs> All right, Anna, you are good. Which means Taylor is next, and then Bailey. Thank you for the hearts. All right, Taylor's here. Let me cleanse my quartz. Thank you so much, Alyssa. Thank you. I appreciate you guys. I wouldn't be able to do this and have this great platform without all of you watching and supporting, too. It is definitely a two-way street here. All right. Taylor for general. Thank you, Bailey. <laughs> I love the cactus. Thank you, Jeannie. I'm feeling a pressure on the right side of my jaw, but it's not like TMJ. I don't know what it is, but it's like, it's deep in like my jaw. Do you like sleep with like your hand like this? Like I feel like someone's almost pushing on my face. Thank you, Anna. I feel like I have to stretch my cheek. I also feel a little bit of pressure on like my mid back. It feels stiff. Thank you for the beaver. Thank you for the paper crane. Ah, can you hear that? That's my job, but it's like, I feel like I need to keep pushing on it. Oh, hold on. I've been messing with it today. I had a sudden accident. Oh, no. I hope you're okay. Yeah, this feels like, I don't know. I don't want to say like a bruise because it's not a bruise, but it doesn't feel like my TMJ, like muscle pain. It just feels like pressure. But my mid back is very, um, very stiff. All right, scoliosis, that makes sense. Oh, the accident was years ago. Okay. Is it something that aggravates you with like rainy weather and stuff like that? Because I typically feel my injuries like that with like rainy or really damp weather. They kind of like come back for a visit. <laughs> Shannon, if you haven't had a one-on-one -on -one yet, um, let me know what you want. Yep, 
Yeah, so if you're clenching and you're like grinding, that could be what it is. But I only feel it on the right side. Yes, Jennifer, when it's rainy, I feel like everything that ever happened to me. <laughs> it's like a history lesson of my injuries. <laughs> okay, I feel like I got some relief, like mid-back. And now I kind of feel like I'm massaging, like, whatever this tightness, tenseness pressure is. <laughs> It's starting to get a little bit of relief there, too. Tingos, yay. <laughs> My favorite. Thank you, Donna. All right, Taylor, I hope you felt that and that helps. Hopefully you get some relief in those areas. All right, hold on, I gotta scroll up because I saw Jill. Anxiety and Shannon. Head. Michelle. Michelle, did you have, were you on the list before for right hip? Because I have a Michelle for right hip that's at like towards the top of the list. I just want to make sure if you're the same Michelle or a different Michelle because they're both spelled the same. Because if that is you and you want general instead, I'm just going to make sure I cross off the other one so I don't mistake it. Good, Taylor. I'm glad. All right, Bailey, you will be next. I just want to give the comments a minute so I can see. And Bailey, you were for stress. Okay, that is you. So you want, okay, so Michelle, you want general now. Okay. Okay, so we'll do Bailey. Then we're going to go to Michelle because Michelle, you were on the list from a previous night. And then we'll go back to Jill and Shannon. Oh, hold on. I got to get, get a new incense. This one's almost burnt out. Let me switch through. 
on a side note, while I'm waiting for this incense to stay lit, um, TikTok finally let me download all of my lives yesterday. So I finally got, there were 22 of them I was behind on. I finally got them all uploaded to YouTube and I have, I think, two to three going live every night now. So for the next week and a half, there's 22 past lives that are going to be popping up. <laughs> so if you're not subscribed on YouTube, go subscribe there. It's the same name as here. Okay. Incense is lit. Let us cleanse. Okay. All right, Bailey, you are up for stress. Thank you, Donna. <laughs> Thank you, Chell. Bailey, I feel a lot in my head, which is usually my symbol for like overthinking, which obviously correlates <laughs> with stress. But it's not like a physical pain. It's definitely more like a mental like state. Nikki, thank you for subscribing. Oh, thank you, Anna. Second week of law school, that sentence just sounds stressful. <laughs> I completely understand the uh <laughs> the mental state of that. It's like, it's like overthinking, fatigue, exhaustion. It's like, I feel like you just like mentally need a, like a break. <laughs> Make sure you definitely take time for yourself. Do not allow yourself to burn out. Abby, thank you for subscribing. I forgot when it expired. <laughs> Sometimes it shows me like so-and-so has 48 hours, but it's like, I don't ever want to put pressure on people. Like if you want to subscribe again, that's completely up to you. I don't want to call people out. <laughs> and some people say they have an auto renew feature. Some people say they don't. So I wonder if it depends on like your country or I don't know. TikTok's always TikToking. When September starts to be in a much better routine. Okay, good. Yes. It sounds like you're busy. It feels like you're busy. So I always want to give like gentle reminders. Like even if it's just five minutes a day, those five minutes add up and they can make the world of a difference for you.
I don't know, it didn't give you enough. Really, it didn't give you an option? That's so weird. I wonder why it does that. Some people say that it only gives them the option where they have to go in and like renew it every month. It doesn't give them an auto renew. And some people say they had an option. I wonder what determines that. My ears just popped. I felt like a pressure release. <laughs> Mine only lets me do a month at a time. See? It's like TikTok. Get your stuff together. There's an option. See? Some people have options. Some people don't. That's so crazy. That's the thing I think that bothers me most about this app is it's so inconsistent from person to person. I don't get it. Thank you, Donna. All right, Bailey, I hope that helps alleviate some of your stress and anxiety. I know you're going to kick butt in law school. We're all definitely rooting for you. It could be phone type. That's true, too. All right. Tracy, I think I saw you. Are you still on? Because I know you were up on the top of the list, too. I switched to my iPad and the names are on my phone. It still handles. Really? Mine only shows names. You're very welcome, Bailey. I found her from CRS. <laughs> Can't remember shit. <laughs> uh. <laughs> Notice how I understood what CRS meant very easily because I suffer from that as well. <laughs> Oh my gosh, I love you guys. You're so funny. <laughs> uh, Alright, I don't know if Tracy is still on, but Michelle, you are next. Because you were like top three on the list. <laughs> CRS Club, yeah. <laughs> we'll forget the meetings. <laughs> we'll like, whose turn was it? <laughs> Okay. <laughs> uh, okay, Michelle, let me know if you are on end ready. Oh, there you are. Sorry, the comments are delayed, so I always feel like no one's there when I'm asking. Okay, Michelle, for the general. He switched it from the hip to general.
So, Michelle, I'm not really feeling hip. I'm feeling like wrist and like a little bit of forearm and throat. My wrists feel tight, almost like, like they're locked in place a little bit. Throat feels tight, like it's almost a little bit closed off. Like I keep going to wave my hands and I feel like I have to like <laughs> push my wrist. Like I feel like I gotta bend them the opposite way to stretch them. Let's do this. Okay, yes. Carpal tunnel definitely resonates. Do you get pain like a little into your forearm as well? I kind of feel it from like, I want to say like here to here. It feels tight. Fingers numb sometimes. Okay, I don't feel much in the fingers. I definitely feel it in like wrist and forearm. All right, throat feels a little more relief, not so tight. I definitely feel a little more movement in my wrist. I don't feel as tight as when I started. Thank you, Donna. All right, Michelle, I hope that gives you some relief. Ooh, hiccups, those are good for throat too. <laughs> okay. I don't know if, let's see if Tracy, I don't think Tracy is on still. Tracy, are you still here? <laughs> I think she might've left. Sorry, I'm going through the list. Um, okay, I don't see. Okay, let me see. Yes, hydrate. Thank you. Okay. We did those. Okay, so Jill, are you still here for anxiety?
All right, so we got Jill and then Shannon. Sorry, my notifications, one, not one notification keeps popping up, it's driving me crazy. Okay, Jill, you're up, and then Shannon. So Jill for anxiety. Instantly got like very twitchy. I don't know if when you're high anxiety, if you get like those, um, like those bursts of adrenaline where you get like very shaky, even though there's no need for you to be like twitchy and shaky, <laughs> as I like to call it. I feel like almost like I can't sit still, like I need to move. <laughs> even my hands are twitching. <laughs> Uh. Yes, okay. Heart racing needs to be doing something, yes. I get that way too when the anxiety like builds and builds and builds and builds. It's like it starts releasing all those like uh, the adrenaline. It's like your body just shakes because it's not really that like fight or flight response. He's at Pamela for pain and depression. Pamela, have you had a one on one yet? I think I had another Pam or Pamela on here. I just want to make sure it's not the same. Yeah, it definitely feels more like um, anxiety based, <clears throat> at least to me. If you already had the one on one, Pam, tonight I'm just trying to finish up the people who haven't had their one-on-ones yet and then moving forward we we're trying to brainstorm earlier ways to um, where if people don't show up for their one-on-ones many sessions within so many times they kind of get bumped off because I don't want it to prevent people from getting their their second ones too And right now, what time is it? It's almost 11.40. I only have like 15, 20 minutes left because I got to take Rosie to school tomorrow. Wah, wah. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, Emily. 
That's definitely never fun. Oh, that's right. I remember you saying your mom had the accident. I hope she's okay. But yeah, that's definitely like a very high stress, high anxiety weekend. It's like once you get to that point and your body stays there, it's hard for it to kind of like come back down from it. And then every little thing just kind of amplifies it. just felt like my neck muscle spasm. <laughs> All right, Jill, I hope you feel much better and that gives you some anxiety relief. Definitely make sure you're taking time for yourself, too, to allow your, your body and your mind to kind of come back down from all that high-stress situations. Don't allow yourself to burn out. Okay, Jill, you are good. Shannon, you are up. Let me just take a minute. And cleanse. Yeah, I have like fifteen minutes left. So I'm probably going to do one more and then just do another selenite cleanse. Because so I don't think I've seen anyone else pop on that was previously on the list. Okay. Shannon. For your head. So Shannon, actually I actually have like my jaws twitching right in here on my right side. I don't feel like a lot of pressure. I almost want to say I almost feel like a little bit of like brain fog is what I would describe it as. And I feel kind of like dazed out, like zoned out a little bit. I actually feel more in my neck going up into my head than I do like up top here, if that makes sense. I feel like I keep wanting to like zoning out, <laughs> like dissociating. Brain fog, okay, yeah, that makes sense. But like, yeah, it's to me, it's all in here. Like, I feel a little bit of jaw, I feel neck. Not so much up here, more like down here.
Like I really want to crack my neck right now for some relief. <laughs> my neck is always problematic and usually causes that aches. Yep, that makes more sense then. For some reason when I was reading, like when you wanted head, I was thinking more up here, but it's definitely down like bottom area. Side. Yep. I'm definitely feeling that. That's where I get my headaches a lot. Those are a lot of like tension and stress headaches. I feel a lot lifting off. So I don't know if you just had a bunch of like stagnant energy in that area. Because it doesn't feel like heavy. I don't know if you feel like that lightness in that area, but you got a lot coming off. <laughs> You're going to sleep great tonight after this. Definitely feels much better. Thank you, Donna. All right, Shannon, I hope you feel better. Okay. So there's still 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17 people still. So the 17 people, whenever they do come on, I am going to honor what they were told about, like, being bummed up to the top of the list. But I think moving forward now, I'm going to have to look into the Google Forms or something just to make it a little easier. You're welcome, Shannon. All right, let's take a minute to stretch and hydrate. Woo, that felt good. Let's do a little selenite. <laughs> Gone at the same time. That definitely means it's time for bed. <laughs> if I miss like that perfect opportune yawning window, 
It's like I get a second wind and then that's it. I'm done. Thank you. Hi, Sarah. Sorry, Bella. Yeah, we're on the very last cleanse. I gotta get to bed. I gotta get Rosie up for school in the morning. Reading the word on makes me on. Yeah, same. Oh, I'm sorry, Sarah. Oh no, Don, did you do something? Is it from walking around Charleston the last couple of days? I know those streets are not like comfortable to walk on with all the pavers and everything, <laughs> depending on where you were. I think I have a video for fibromyalgia. If I do, it's under the um, the physical playlist on my page. Oh, that, that stinks, Donna. Good, I'm glad you feel pretty good. My left ear just started to get itchy. Ow. East Bay Street. That sounds familiar, but I can't picture it. Hi, Linda. This is a selenite or satin spar wand. We use it for cleansing and protecting in the beginning and end of the sessions. Oh, I just got tingles on my scalp. <laughs> oh, great. <laughs> Sorry, something stuck on my thumb. Thank you, Gigi.
Oh, hey, good. You're welcome, Sarah. Thank you for joining me tonight. I know it was different because Michelle couldn't hop on, but I'm glad we got to knock out a few of your one-on-one -on -one sessions. <laughs> Thank you everyone for 15 shares and oh, it's almost 22.2 thousand likes. It's almost 222. I gotta watch it now. I gotta see when it changes. <laughs> Thank you. Ah, there it is, 222. See, all those repeating numbers. <laughs> um, tomorrow night, I should be on, but I'm not sure what time I'm going to start. If it's going to be closer to 10 or 1030, that I don't know. We shall see. And then this Wednesday, I think, is the dual live with Samantha, I think it's Wednesday, who is level up healing. So definitely make sure you tune in with that. I've had a lot of you guys commenting on my page about her, so I'm excited to to meet her and do a do a live with her too. Thank you guys for all the gifts, tips, and donations. I appreciate that. Welcome to all the new subscribers. Thank you. Oh, yeah, now it's 22.7. <laughs> All right, guys, I love you. Have a great night. And Donna, thank you again for, for timing all the the one-on-ones. And thank you to the mods, as always, for helping answer questions and keep it a safe, positive, peaceful place for all of us. All right, guys, I love you. Have a good night, and I will see you next time. Bye.